So I'm still working on the Fox body door jam. This is the second half of it. Uh, I did all the work for the inside sheet metal. I just cut it along and I did the L. Uh, like I said, I was going to do in the first video. That way I could keep most of the original sheet metal. Uh, the outside one is from the parts car. And I just did all the plug welds on there. Uh, just pretty much go in a circle and then fill in the middle. So I'm working on the top half for the outer piece. Uh, it's pretty much just making it so it's pretty close to it. I can take a bit and redo the circle. Uh, the antenna hole is supposed to be right there. Uh, There's going to be a drag car, so I'm not going to have the hole there, but you can just redrill it and do a couple measurements so you know where to put the hole. But for the most part, it's coming along fairly decent. I still need to cut that top off. Uh, this is supposed to be pretty much like a triangle come up, goes flat, and then goes down. This is, it, then it needs to come out. I still got to bend this outward. Uh, you can see the gap that's in there. So, bending this out, and then when I do the outside piece, I can keep kind of messing with it until I have them matched together. Because this actually comes, curves out and then curves down. It's a drag car, but I still want it to be pretty close to how it should look. And plus, where the door is and the fender and everything matches, it's going to keep the gap small. So when you're actually looking at it, you're not going to see it. Uh, as far as for doing the top half of it, this center piece, that's it. It's just a triangle. You're not really doing anything. It doesn't have, it doesn't extend. Uh, it just gets welded along there. I got it pretty close. Uh, the outside piece, which is a part of the outer skin of it, which makes up this rusted away piece that is supposed to come over and right here where the recess is it's supposed to come over go into that recess this gap right there is supposed to come to that platform this one right here and then just be a little square uh, it doesn't extend anywhere else the lower part of the cow it's supposed to come over, and in the first video you can see where it's kind of at an angle. Making that piece would be easier to just do it in three sections, uh, or you can try to do the bend. I tried to do it in one piece just to make this, and I wasn't getting anywhere just because it all steps. It comes and it steps up and then it steps up again. So three pieces would probably be easier. Uh, when you do it, you just do this curve and then stop here and bend the metal down. And then you can do another piece here, bend it down, and then do another piece to go there. Since this is a drag car, all this is going to be cut out and just be flat sheet metal in there. I chose to top, cut the top of the cowl off just because it would be easier uh, to get in there versus trying to weld upside down. So I have to re weld it there, but. The second cut is underneath the plastic of the cowl, so I, I don't have to get too perfect with it. That'll just be my main concern of welding that together and do the body filler and then do the spot welds along the edge. But it's getting there. Uh, I, this top corner I cut off because on the parts car for this inner sheet was all rusted away. So I just welded in another piece from the original section that was there <clears throat> so it is getting there for the outside for making that uh, I just kind of whipped up this piece and then I can just trim it down because it's supposed to go in there uh, some of the useful tools you're going you're gonna need the body clamps to hold the panels together. You're going to need the long style reach ones because they, these can reach back in there and be able to hold the outside to the inside and then you can just work it down as you do the plug welds. And that's welded. I didn't weld it all the way because I still got to fix all the rust that's 
on the top of it, but for the most part, it's coming together. It's, I think that doing these outer pieces is taking me longer than what it took me to do the inside. So it's a little bit more difficult than I thought it was, but just time consuming trying to get the bends. But I'll do another one once I get it all welded together and do a final product.